Hey everybody, welcome back to the last early mutation. We'll be doing Stukov for this last one. Uh, my partner CTG will be Phoenix. I'm probably sure he's just going to be going for like a robo build or something like that. Uh, but we will see. I'm going to do a 14 supply barracks because I want to try to get out my um, bunkers as fast as possible here. Um, and the early attack wave comes pretty darn quick. Uh, we have Hardened Will, by the way, Inspiration, and he Heroes of the Storm, which is basically just going to mean that all the attack waves just hit pretty hard, and any sort of burst damage doesn't do as much. I was very much tempted to do less of the explosive infested, but I decided that, you know what, it makes sense for me to have it. Um, it's still only 15%, it's not like they're all going to be explosive. Uh, but, like, I did a game as Zagara earlier. Yeah, he's doing the Robo build. I did a game earlier as Zagara, and I thought, okay, my first set of Bailings will do a lot of work. Nope. The, the Hardened Will, or sorry, uh, yeah, Hardened Will, makes it so basically you do no, no damage to any sort of thing that does a big burst damage. So, very, very tough to deal with a lot of early attack waves. I'm going to be using the Apocalypse pretty much right off the bat here. Leave both these guys there. I need to make an Overlord now because I really don't have the ability to make anything yet because I wasted all of my um, supply on the bunkers. This in front of those, so maybe we can pull a little aggro away. Feels like it's not a super fast attack wave, so that's good. Leave this guy here. Patrol. I'm gonna move this guy over here. Start working on my extra command center. Can I keep an eye on the infest structure as well? Okay, it's Vikings. That's actually not so bad here. This is actually a pretty decent one. Do not want a partner to lose his first immortal because that would be very bad. Okay, cool. Okay, so now that we got all that done, I'm gonna get one of these and a bunch of workers. That's really all I need at the moment. Apocalypse. I'm gonna save the Apocalypse because I don't think I need it yet. Normally would do it right away, but I wanna save it for the next one. The next one's going to be an Overlord. Put that there, put that there. Really, I'm just about getting up the tech tree and... Um, Making workers right now is really all I can really focus on. Everything else has just got to be those two. Otherwise, we're going to find ourselves in a very weird position where I don't have any minerals to do anything. Tychus. One more bunker. And then we'll just make a bunch of...
lost the sand. I'll make a bunch of bunkers soon. Get this guy up from there. Get everybody to hang out here for a second. Okay, now that that's done, I'm gonna make a bunch of. There are bunkers in the middle here. Move these guys. There. And there. Hold back for just a second. Yeah, 50 seconds. There's no way I'm going to get out a apocalypse for this attack wave. I do want to do this so that at least I don't need a partner who will have something to pull back for a second. Heart of the Will just does a lot of work there, so we have to be very careful. Alright, now let's get these and this. I'm doing a lot of AoE there, so that's kind of nice. Our allies are engaged in battle. Go ahead, and I'm just going to keep everything rallied right around here at the moment. I um, don't want to get too far out. Let's get the last upgrades. Let me put one more over here, yeah. That rally over there. But we are going to have to eventually worry about other things too. So. Get that there. Make sure we have the leap next. Wow, it actually... Wow, I didn't know that. It keeps the things. Okay, I want to do that now. Oh, okay, so yeah, I'm going to have the drop. Zeratul is not going to be horrible. I'm going to do that when I can. Now, I do have to be very careful about when um, Artanis shows up. That, would, that one's going to be tough to deal with. Mostly just because he does this really good AoE, and so does um, Kerrigan. Okay. We still have a long time before we have to worry about anything else. Go ahead and get the extra thing for the bunkers. I'll start building an extra layer of bunkers. A couple extra workers out of the field. Leave the apocalypse for attack waves. See, unfortunately, tanks aren't going to do a lot here, but I feel like I might as well get them. Like I said, I have to be very careful here about not losing everything. Our chance. 
He's got an AoE, so let's carry him. I'm just gonna remove these guys. I think that'll move him. Yeah, see, I did not want to get hit by those. Yeah, that's why I moved all the bunkers out of the way, because I did not want to mess with that. Would not have been good. Some more tanks. That's really about it. Everything else is going to go move out. That's the one thing you have to be very careful about here, and that's why I unloaded my bunkers. I wanted things away from my army. I did not want to have to deal with that. Because things can get out of hand, like I said, extremely quick here. And if you don't have the right thing, oh my god, it can be so bad. You turrets. in 34 seconds. I think I'll be able to tank a decent amount of this. There's Rainer. Sorry. Rainer, Zagara. Just slowly unload these things. Car still alive. That's hilarious. Okay, I'm gonna save the Alexander for another attack wave. what I'm trying to do for my partner here. What's nice is all these interceptors really don't do very much in regards to a lot of this. Uh, in regards to the hardened will, it really doesn't hurt too much. Let's drop this here. I want to start working on those enemies now.
smoke is still there. Our allies are engaged in battle. That's so funny. Again, Nova just has snipe, has so many things. soon or we should die soon yeah this was okay um yeah i felt like because i've dealt with this twice already and numerous times the first time i did this i felt it was very important for me to be very on top of um, making sure that i didn't have the fight in the middle of my bunkers and any fight that found its way to the middle of my bunkers I immediately spread them in a circle around because there's a lot of AoE there that can do a lot of horrible things and I did not want to mess with that at all. I did not want to have Kerrigan with her destruction of Apocalypse thing to just absolutely destroy everything um, so Stukov is good more micro than you might think for this one though um, and saving your cooldowns a little more than I personally have done in the past. Anyways, I'm Andre Five. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. Hope you enjoyed.